At that time of the run play, they get penetration, they get in the backfield, and they make the tackle for a loss. Mason lined up in a single back formation. On the money. That's a missed opportunity, and now they'll have to bring out the defense. Well, here you are in the second half, and your team is losing. How about that defense coming up with a fourth down stop, gets the ball back for their offense. That is a tremendous job by the defense. Halfway through the third quarter, here's the handoff. Twins is an animal on that play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Second and 11. The defense gets a sack. Well, that time the quarterback didn't hold the football. The left side of the line just, they just collapse. He doesn't even feel it or see it, and he goes down for the sack. Third and long. Manning's looking to go down the field here. Intercepted. That'll stop the play right there. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. First down on the way. Fritz in the slot. Three-step drop. Brought down after a gain of 15. Good job by the offense here. It was a good lead in the second half, picking up that first down, and that's what you want to do. Take your time, look at the play clock, take it down as low as you can, and keep a foot race to the end zone. The 20, the 10, touchdown! When you got a lead and you march down the field and you add on to that lead with a touchdown, it's fun to watch the other team. Will they stay patient or will they panic? My bet is they'll panic. The Rams line up for the extra point. And the extra point is good. The Giants have let this one get away from them today. Need to try and turn things around in a hurry. The score's 28 to 0. Fields the football at the three. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. The Giants come to the line. They'll start this drive at the 24. First down at the 24. Has his target and he's tackled at the 34-yard line. First down here after the completion. Split backfield here. And Jennings handed the football. And they bring it down at the 36-yard line. The Giants have tried a couple of different ways to get the running game going, but it hasn't paid off. And Jennings been shut down from his very first carry on. No balance by this offense, like you said today. They can't run the football, but I've said this all the time. It's not all balls out. They bring him to the turf. Well, that time the offense... Officials stop play now. They want to take another look at that last play. So now they're going to take a look at whether the knee was down before the ball came out. Well, when we look at this, let's look when the knee hits the ground. And as we look at it, when the knee hits the ground, does he still have total control of the football? 
if you deem him to have total control, then it is not a fumble. After review of the play, the ruling on the field stands. And after a quick review, the word has come in, the play on the field will stand. The Rams come onto the field for their next series. Now first and ten. Play action. Wants to go deep. And they can't connect. Just not a good decision by the quarterback. I mean, maybe on the sidelines they keep calling the wrong plays, but he's attacking the strength of this cover two defense. Don't do that. Throw where they're not. That's deep down the middle. Looking to go deep. Clutch catch. That brings the play to an end. Once again, this offense in the red zone. This defense has been awful all day long. Can they, can they bow their necks a little and show a little toughness and maybe stop them this time? Let's see how they back up the big play here. They come to the line, and it's first down. First down following the long play. The margin is increased with another touchdown. The fullback in most offenses in the NFL very seldom gets to carry the football, but down near the goal line, they serve a good purpose. Quick hitting plays by a big, powerful guy gets it done. The Rams will kick it away momentarily. They were able to capitalize on great field position following the fumble, and they'll be hoping the defense can help them out like that once more. And this will be coming out to the 20 as he thinks better of running it out of the end zone this time. The Giants offense ready now to see what it can do. It's an empty backfield for Manning this time. First down and 10. He makes the catch. The tackle is made. Well, you're really in a tough spot. That is a good job picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. All you can do, just keep picking up those first downs. You hope it leads you to a score, and then you play the game from there. First down at the 34. Throws the pass. Brings it in. Taken down just two yards short of the first. Nice job by the quarterback finding the open guy short. They get the completion. They still do not get the first down, though. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. And Jennings going to take the handoff now. Now third and short following the run. Manning set. Everybody emptied out for this snap. Out of the shotgun formation. Has a catch for the first. And he's tackled down after picking up the first. Well, that'll make you feel a little better. Finally getting a first down. You're down big in the second half, and you're on the offensive side. Don't look for the quick score. Just look to pick up positive yards and hope it leads you to a score later. Very nearly intercepted. I know we've all heard this phrase before. That's why they're playing defense, because they can't catch. Hey, the coaches don't care about that. When you get an opportunity, they want you to make the catch. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Second and ten. Makes the catch inbounds. Good job that time by the quarterback. Throw the short pass, even though it doesn't result in a first down. Now on third and short, all of your passes are in play instead of just the third long where you only have like three or four plays you can go to. Looking across the middle, no one's going to get him now. The 10, all the way home and all alone. Touchdown. Well, we're talking about some of the fastest humans on earth. And we take into account you can't touch them or breathe on them. That's how they're able to get open and make so many catches. Add the extra point, the kick is good. Everyone's lined up for this kickoff. Downs the one who brings him to the ground. This series begins for the offense with a very good chance to score. 
Hills lined up. Two tight end set. Takes it on the counter. They'll mark him at the 28. Running backs, they love counter runs. They know when a defense has been over pursuing, so they make that fake one way, and when they cut it back, there's Let's usually a great running lane there. Mason's going to secure the handoff. Good piece of tackling. This is an awesome job by the head coach, the offensive coordinator, and the offense. Just keep picking up those first downs. You got a big lead here in the second half. Keep that clock running. First down at the 21. Has Austin able to make the tackle of about two yards shy of the first. The Rams lead here in the second half, and a big reason why is their quarterback. Hills had a huge performance in this one. When you talk about creating opportunities, that's where you have to give credit to the coaching staff. They have helped the players. The play designs have been good. Just two minutes left of this one. We're back now for the end of the fourth quarter. From the gun. Leaps up and comes away with it. Kim, when you look at the situation right here, you, you have a big lead. You're down near the goal line ready to score. And what you do to be a good sport, you just line up, you try to score, but you do it with a running play. Tackles made. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Second and goal from the five. Pulls it in. Well, I tell you, it's getting ugly out here. That was a good job on that touchdown that time. And I'll tell you, there's nothing like being on top of the other team and make them chase you. An extra point is good. The Giants prepared to return the kickoff. No return. The ball's coming out to the 20. The Giants come onto the field now for this next series. Nickel formation here for the defense. Gun, 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 gun. Manning's back in shotgun formation. No one was open. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. Second down and 10. to his hands. Ball is out. Oh, they cough up the football, and the defense takes possession. Well, that's what you call a takeaway. That time, the defense just hit the ball carrier so hard that he had to give the football up, and they lose it. First and ten. Cunningham's taking the handoff. And he's tackled. He'll be a yard short of the first. Well, how about that, Jim? Not a surprise. Down the red zone one more time. They're blowing them out. And this offense has been spectacular. What will they do here? You know what? I think they'll just run it and try to end this game. Hill's going to take it from the gun. Kenny Britt pulls it in. Hard to throw the football down the field once you get in the red zone. That time, the quarterback, well, he knows that. And he looks down there, nobody open deep, throws it short, and they get a nice solid pickup on that play call. And that's a two-yard game. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Mason's got it on the handoff. In the end, it picks up only a yard. This team likes to throw the football in the end zone once they get inside the red zone. This is a nice changeup. They fool them. Well, they thought they were going to fool them with the run, but it only gets a short game. Cunningham's handed the football, and this won't even get back to the line. They'll end up losing one. The Giants defensive coordinator, my gosh, he is one happy guy. Anytime you get in the backfield and stop a runner and make him lose yards, that's some good stuff. 
Phil, before we go, how about this win? How much will this one count? You know, Jim, all wins are nice. This one was done easy. You didn't have to sweat too much over it. You feel good.